all good things must come to an end as winter at Dilworth Park closes. The event held annually in front of City Hall is a staple of the winter season here in Philadelphia, with thousands of residents and tourists visiting the exhibit each year. From early November to late February, guests were treated to food, drinks, and ice skating. But as we enter March, our first interviewee, Jersey native Slash Fires fan, Fred Sheeswell, was unwilling to let go of the frigid air just yet. Well, I'm not looking for spring right now. I still want uh, winter hockey. <laughs> want I haven't had enough time on the ice. You know, where I live, I have ponds and they haven't frozen properly, so I'd still love to get some ice time. However, some were looking forward to the spring more than others. Philly resident Nicolette Miller had some hopes for the season ahead. Uh, what are you looking forward to in spring? Um, warm weather and just kind of, I don't know, outdoor beer gardens, um, kind of just being able to walk around the city and not, not be cold. And it's just, I feel like the city's just so much more vibrant and fun when, when it's nice out and everyone's just kind of like everywhere. Everyone's out and about doing things and it's, it's nice when it's warm. So. And if you're looking for something to do once things begin to heat up here in the city, Nicolette has a few suggestions. Um, I really enjoy, so Northern Liberties, I feel like, has a ton of really cool outdoor, like, beer gardens, like Frankfurt Hall, and Garage is fun, and um, a lot of places around there are just fun to kind of just be outside and be drinking and hanging out with people, so. Mm -hmm. Reporting for Temple Update, this is Colin Fawning.